This morning, I would like to speak something about the church. We are going to speak something about the importance of every member of the body. Each one has its own function that they can do for the benefit of the full body. 1 Corinthians chapter 12, verses 14 to 19. For the body is not one member, but many. If the foot shall say, because I am not the head, I am not the body, is it therefore not of the body? And in verse 16, And if the ear shall say, because I am not the eye, I am not the body, is it therefore not the body? Now in verse 17, If all the body were an eye, where would be the hearing? If all hearing, where would be the smelling? But now God has set the members, each one of them, in the body as it has pleased him. The good thing is, God is a very good architect of all things. He places each one to function in their own ability according to the gift as God placed them into their own places. And in 19, and if they were all one member, where would be the body? Apostle Paul was right. God places everything in order, in their proper order, so that they could function correctly. No one can say others are not needed. We are all members of the body of Christ who believes in our Lord Jesus Christ. And if anyone of us is hurting, each one feels the same. So in interdependent are the members that what affects one affects all. We are the most important body in the entire world. We members of the body of Christ is connected to the head, our Lord Jesus Christ, in which God himself placed Jesus as head of the church. The church did the head so that life could be sustained in it. And we are here connected all the time. We can live separated 